Hi, this is uh, Ivan Fernandez and I'm here to test the different kinds of bottled waters and tap water and um, compare it to my ionized uh, alkaline water. Um, I'm going to test it uh, first with, uh, using this ORP meter. Uh, ORP stands for oxidation reduction potential and what it basically does is uh, it tests its uh, um, the, uh, the levels of antioxidants that the water has so basically if it's uh, a positive number that means that um, it doesn't have any uh, antioxidants in them but if it measures in negative number that means that it has a lot of uh, antioxidants in in them so what I have here are different bottled waters uh, I'm also gonna test our water here in Kent Washington so, grab a tap water um, I'm gonna put this here for now and I have your Sprite, so I'm going to put a little bit of Sprite here. So basically, the uh, testing the uh, ORP for antioxidants is, is like um, what makes the nails rust and what makes the apples uh, um, turn brown what I have here is Aquafina so and this one is a Fred Meyer pur purified drinking water this is a uh, Gatorade Propel It's a Kroger uh, blueberry from Manganet uh, uh, sparkling water. And this one is a uh, refresh. Uh, I got this uh, from. Um, they sell this in some of the deli stores. This one is a Fiji natural artisan water. Okay, now we go here. This one is the uh, arrowhead. This one is uh, called Ethos Water. I got this at uh, Starbucks. The Sunny Water. And Nestle Pure Life Water. Here is a uh, Kirkland water, the one that they sell at Costco. So I'll put it right here, right next to it. Huh? Put it right here for now. So, uh, you see my ORP meter. I will start uh, with the 
I'll start with the uh, Nestle Pure uh, Pure Life. So basically, um, you want to see uh, if it's uh, you'll see uh, the negative sign in there. If, if it's negative, then that means it's good. Positive, that means that it doesn't have antioxidants in them. So here we go. So right now, it's about 200, 230 and climbing to 40. So, and there's no negative sign, so it's a positive 200. 40, 50 climbing. Now we're going to test the, the sunny water. Sunny water around 280, positive 280 and climbing. So the Ethos water. This one is 300, 300 positive 300. Uh, the arrowhead is about positive 260 something, 200, positive 260 something. The Fiji water is about positive 254 the refresh is about 275 and climbing 280 and climbing the Blueberry Promagnus Sparkling Water from Kroger oh, It's about 366 365 Positive 370 390 The Propel Gatorade is about 312 Let me remove this one for now The Fred Meyer Purified Drinking Water It's about positive 360 and climbing The Aquafina Aquafina is about 343 positive 345 46 sprite it's about positive 390 and I think I said that this one was the uh, the tap water here in Kent, Washington. This one have about positive 430. And this one is the uh, Kirkland. Kirkland water. It's about positive uh, 340. Uh, now what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm, gonna I'm gonna test the Tiant Wine uh, uh, Water Ionizer. And 
I'm gonna put it right here. And actually, yeah, I'm gonna put it right here on the end. Put it right here. And I don't know if you guys can see it on the right side that there's that negative sign. So so it's about 200 minus n negative 260, 70, two, minus 200, 